Hello everyone, so as you could already guess, in today's episode we are reviewing a desk lamp. But not just a regular desk lamp, this one is designed with creative people in mind. So this desk lamp is designed by relatively small company Redgrass. And Redgrass is mostly known for their products geared towards miniature painters. Since they had a great success with their wet palette, now they're entering market with a new product suitable for broader audience. Redgrass R9 desk lamp is really one of its kind. It is designed and calibrated in accordance to the latest CRI rating standards. CRI stands for the Color Rendering Index. And in this lamp it is very close to perfect, so it means you will see the real color of objects, paint, pigments, when they are lit by this lamp. By the way, it has anti flicker technology, so it means it should be great for content creators as myself. And followed by that, it has color temperature of 5000 Kelvin, so it means no more yellow or blue tint in your photos or videos. Plenty of other great features that you can read about in official website. So obviously, without laboratory grade equipment, I won't be able to give you a proper test results for color rendition of this lamp or exact illuminance ratings. But I can give you honest opinion as a scale modeler and content creator. So this is what I will do. Redgrass R9 lamp comes in this nice protective box that can later be reused for transportation purposes. You will also get detachable power adapter and high quality desk clamp with rubberized anti-slip pad. So immediately after unboxing, we are greeted by high quality construction and materials. All joints and screw holes are nicely concealed and not visible. All cables are nicely routed internally and only visible in a swivel point. And most important and actually amazing thing is, the wall lamp is made out of aluminium, with exception of few plastic pieces on top. So now you're looking at my current workbench setup with two generic desk lamps and two light bulbs meant for photography softboxes. Most of videos on my channel were made by using these two lamps. It wasn't the best, but it did job quite well. Cost of this setup was about 70 euros or about 80 dollars. Overall, it was quite a versatile setup, but not without flaws. Light bulbs are quite bulky and blocks my vision. And because reflectors are too small, light bulb won't go completely in. And if you can see, there is a small amount of flickering happening on a video. So let's switch to the Redgrass R9 lamp. Please keep in mind, I have not changed any of the camera settings. As you can see, the image is quite a bit brighter. And also, lamp itself is positioned higher above the table. And even if I'm using a single Redgrass lamp, I'm not losing any of the versatility of two lamps. Boom arm construction actually reminds premium quality microphone stand. And because construction is so solid, I really have to apply some force in order to adjust it. And that's obviously a good thing. By rotating light bars, we can really adjust and tune the light source. As you can see, I'm creating nice backdrops, shadows and other lighting variations. And this I can really appreciate as a content creator. Once again, let's see the comparison with my old setup. Using same camera settings, I have brighter image and no image flickering. So that's already a big improvement on its own. So let's get a closer look at these light bars. So what looked to be a gimmick actually proved to be one of the best features of this lamp. 
As you can see, each light bar has a diffuser that creates a nice shadows and even distribution of light. Not only we can change the direction of light source, but also the brightness level. By pressing and holding button on top, we can decrease or increase brightness. This allows for even more flexibility and professional look. This especially is true when working with monochrome models. I honestly believe this lamp should be a perfect fit for your miniature photography sessions. So this scene is much closer to the real workbench scenario. As you can see, workbench is much cleaner and everything is lit up evenly. And when scene is cropped for video, we get nice and pleasant picture. Not only it looks good on video, but it is pleasure to work with your model when light does not induce any eye strain. And also I am finally able to use lamp above my head and not in front of my face. And of course, model making is not only hobby that could benefit from use of this lamp. Me personally, I am completely converted and will not look back to my old lamp setup whatsoever. This being a single piece system is a killer feature for me. And if you ever used your airbrush close to the generic desk lamp, you know how hard it can be to clean it. And trust me, you have to clean lamps in order to avoid dust in clear coats of your models. So far, only good things are being said about this lamp. So what's the catch? Well, so first con is, you will not be able to buy this lamp yet. The second thing, it is quite pricey. For Europe customers, Kickstarter launch price is planned to be at 200 euros. So I already mentioned that boom arm reminds a high quality premium microphone stand. And those don't even have any kind of electronics inside and sometimes may cost the same. And there is also a true that products after successful Kickstarter launch tend to get a hike in price. And if this lamp will cost more than 200 euros, I will think twice before recommending it. As for now, this product stands in category of its own, and this is something that we modelers and creative people deserved for a long time. Also, I'm not in any way associated with Redgrass company. I was lucky enough to receive one review unit, so big thanks to them, and I strongly believe they will have a successful Kickstarter launch. If you do as well, make sure to check their campaign. Thank you for watching and see you soon in my next modeling episode.